haven't even touched your tea. Jalen, does it taste okay? Oh. Not too bitter, is it? Oh, it's fine. Matter of fact, it's perfect. <laughs> you are the most wonderful host, Annika. Why, thank you, Amy. Though I was a little surprised that you invited us. Whatever do you mean, Cadence? Well, it's just... Uh, what I mean to say is we weren't exactly the nicest to you in school. That was a long time ago, Cadence. Well, not being nice is kind of the light of it. We were downright mean to you. How can you forgive us? We tortured you. Literally tortured. We feel awful. Let bygones be bygones. That's what my mama always told me. She sounds like a wonderful person. This was a special recipe. When I was a little girl, we used to bake cookies together. Cookies with my mama. We'd have tea parties, much like this one. We'd sit down and we'd drink some tea and we'd talk about how our day went. How special. It was, wasn't it? So tell me, how was your day? Well, pretty uneventful. This is the highlight of my day. Well, that can't be true. I'm afraid it is. With that fancy car you're sitting outside? I highly doubt that. How about you, Cadence? You have a child now. How is the little whippersnapper? Growing quick. It seems like just yesterday that I saw you pregnant in the grocery store. You looked so happy. You married a doctor, if I remember correctly. I did. He's a wonderful man. It must be the perfect life. Jalen, how about you? Oh, I'm not married yet. Oh, but you have that successful business, making money hand over fist. Suppose you could say that. Let me guess, that's what got you that big old fancy house on the lake. <laughs> now, how about you, Danica? Um, I've been good. Whatever happened to Mike? Can we please not talk about him? I'm sorry, I was just wondering. Please, it's just... <laughs> said, I don't want to talk about him. Well, I don't think Amy meant anything by it. Right, Amy? Right. That's fine. Just don't want to talk about him. We were sorry to hear about your baby. Tell you what, I've got some banana bread in the kitchen. That sounds good. Good? Honey, it's to die for. Pure heaven. Something the matter? Absolutely not. Everything is fine. You haven't even touched your cookie. Oh, we were just waiting for our gracious host. Oh, you are too kind. That's odd. I didn't, wasn't expecting any company. Well, except for you wonderful ladies, that is. <laughs> <laughs> Please, excuse me. Oh, certainly. Hello, officer. Afternoon, ma'am. Can I help you? See, I got a call. More like a complaint. About there being a funny smell here at the house. Funny smell? I've just been cooking for my friends, if that's what you mean. Mm-hmm. Ma'am, you okay? Why, I'm perfect. Your hands? What about my hands? Is that your blood, ma'am? Blood? What are you talking about? Ma'am, do you need a doctor? Don't be silly. Come in, come in. Who's what I will? Holy hell. <coughs> the 
officer here th seems to think that the smell of my cooking is bothering the neighbors. Well, that's absurd. I know, right? The only thing I can smell is your wonderful cooking. <laughs> Sheriff, would you like to join my tea party? <laughs>